Hello, we're here at AQS Quilt Week in Lancaster for the 2019 AQS Quilt Week show. And we're gonna take you on a little tour so you can see all of the things that are going on right here at the show. We're standing here in the lobby of the Lancaster County Convention Center. And you'll notice that one of the things we have right here is the drawing for the Genomi and Elna sewing machines. You wanna make sure you sign up because we give a sewing machine away every single day during the quilt show. You just put your name in the iPad and we'll download those and the winners will be chosen every single day. So as we move through the lobby, you're gonna see that on our right, we have our package check. And our admission desk is right here. You're gonna stop here and pay your admission, which is $14 a day or $11 if you're an AQS member. And the AQS Information Center is right here on the left, on the right. They handle will call. You can buy tickets there. Also, you can join AQS at that station and pay your admission. So now we're entering the exhibit hall. Of course, one of the first things that you're going to see is the AQS booth. And we're gonna stop right here and talk with Linda Smith. And you're wearing the pretty I show shirt. Beautiful show shirt this year. We also have four other shirts. We have books, kits, fabric, just anything you need to have about sewing we've got. We also have some special books this year that match our exhibits that we have here. We have the beautiful Prince exhibit. We have Judy Martin's exhibit. And we that's, also... That's the Lone Star. The Lone Stars. Yes. And then we also have our... Um, from the 14th Nihon, Nihon, Nihon exhibit, exhibit from Japan. From Japan. All yes. right. So if you need your souvenirs, you want to stop here and we see do. Linda? We She'll have, help um, you. Yes, we have our mugs this year. We have some beautiful quilted coasters that look like barn quilt blocks. And they're made out of fabric? No, they're made out of stone. Okay. They're regular oh, star stone. stone. Yes, ma'am. Okay. And we have some beautiful note cards this year. People have been asking for note cards. We have those. We have our quilt art is just fresh off the press for the year. Come see us. All right. This is AQS. All right. Now, the other thing you're going to see right across from the AQS booth is the giveaway. This year we're giving away three different trips as part of our grand giveaway. First prize is a trip to Japan to the big exhibit in Tokyo. The second prize is to a, a package for two to attend the fall Paducah quilt show. The third prize is a gift certificate for two people to take a cruise uh, with seminars at sea. So make sure you sign up for that. We're gonna give lots of prizes away and somebody's gonna win. So as we move through the exhibit hall, you're going to see that we have vendors of all kinds. If you're in the market for a sewing machine, you wanna make sure that you are, uh, that you come to the show and try them out because every major brand is here. All right, we're going to stop here and talk to oh. Kenny Pillman. Hi. Now, pleasure, Kenny, Bonnie. you're from Lancaster, right? I am. Welcome home. Yes, that's great. <laughs> okay, and so you run the Rachels of Greenfield. With so my wife, Rachel. your wife does all the yep, designing. She does. And so what do you have new in your booth? This is our newest little kit, and it follows the tradition of all of our projects. We put our things together as complete kits, which means you get the fabrics for the top, plus the backing, binding, batting, everything, patterns and instruction books. We include embellishments, full-size quilting designs, whatever you need, the kits are complete. They're all there. Yeah. All right, well, enjoy the show. Thank Thanks you. for talking Pleasure with us. So it doesn't make any difference what you're in the market for, whether it's fabric or whether it's thread or sewing machines, you're gonna see that we have a little bit of all of that in the show. If you're into some uh, quilty style garments, you're gonna see some of those in some of our booths here. And one thing I will encourage you to do is that a lot of the vendors do demonstrations. So please stop and watch. You'll get to learn a trick or two from them. 
Hobbs Bonded Fibers is here at the show and they are one of our show sponsors. Now I'm going to stop here and I'm going to talk to Sharon here in the AQS, no, in the AccuQuilt booth. All right, now Sharon, AccuQuilt is a show sponsor. Yes. They also provide the cutting equipment in our classroom. Correct. And what else do you have new? We have the new Go Me. This came out in November. It's, it's geared towards children. We want to get children engaged in sewing, creating crafts. So there's a number of projects inside the box that they can do. There's a fabric kit um, so they can start learning how to sew. Mm -hmm. You can do all these cute little shapes, hair ties, um, barrette buys, uh, uh, ties, pencil case. Pencil case. Different mug animals. Mug rugs, mug rugs. Yes, probably nine or ten different animals. Okay. All right. Well, we're glad you're here with us again today. Thank and you. Hope you have a great show. You too. Okay, so now if you look off to my right, you're going to see we have some demos going on. And of course, you can get all kinds of demos from the, the sewing machine companies on the different style of machines that they do. Now I'm going to stop right here and have a visit with Bruce. Bruce, come see us. Hi, All right. good morning, good now, morning. You know, Bruce is well known for his batiks, but tell Thank us you. what you have new this time. Well, good morning, and uh, this, today we're debuting our 100% cotton, 72-inch jersey knits. Uh, they're brand new, uh, straight from a special factory uh, on the island of Java, uh, and uh, we're really proud of them. And they're right over here. Can I take you to them? Sure. Let's go Come look at over. them. We have about 35 different combinations. And they're all made from uh, very finest cotton, long uh, fibers, uh, knitted uh, very carefully using size 40 yarns. Uh, there are various stamps and hand-dyed coordinates. Uh, one yard makes a, a, a t-shirt because it's uh, so wide and it's draped and set up for a being a comfort fabric with no lycra or spandex, very, very comfortable. And do you know what? If I were going to make a dress, I probably only need my length, That's don't correct. I? Because You've it's 72 it. inches wide. That's the beauty of Hope it. Hope I'm not 72 inches around yet. God forbid. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not at all. Yeah. But yes, that's the whole, that's the joy of it. And um, it sews beautifully, machine washable. Feels great, too. Put it in the dryer. Um, we're, we're quite proud of it. So this is our first lineup of it, about 35 different combinations. So we hope uh, folks come on down to the show so we can show them off. Yes, and I know one of my favorites is the rayons that you carry yes. that are also batik. We're continuing with our lineup of rayons. Actually, we're expanding it. We now have over a hundred different rayon oh, skews. Wow. Uh, styled for everyday wear. You don't have to be going on a cruise to wear so batik rayon. <laughs> All right. Although, I highly recommend it. <laughs> Thanks for visiting with us. Thanks for stopping by. See you soon. Come to the show. <laughs> All right, now we're headed right into the large quilts. And so the large quilts are located here in Freedom Hall. And we have beautiful quilts. We have beautiful quilts every year. And we always say, can they get any better? And yes, they do get better every single year. And of course, at the end of this aisle, is where we have our best of show and our other top winners. Best of show was won by Janet Stone, and Janet is from Kansas. The, the best original design is made by Sachiko Chiba from Japan. Best Hand Workmanship is by Andra Strack from Germany. And 
Our best movable machine workmanship is by Jan Hutchison, and she's also for Kansas. I guess they have bad weather, weather in Kansas where they're doing some quilting in the winter time. All of these are our four of our top winners. In Freedom Hall, we also have a few of our special exhibits. So we're gonna work our way down through this vendor row. Again, you'll see have quilts on the right, more vendors on the left. You're in the market for batting, irons, uh, kits of all kinds. You saw the, the kits that are in Rachel's of Greenfield's booth. But we have a variety of kits being offered by our vendors right here in Freedom Hall. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hello. Hello. And where are you going? So now we're in our special exhibits here in Freedom Hall. Each show we choose one of our instructors to be the featured instructor. And at this show, it's Beth Ann Nemish. And she starts with the very first quilt she ever made. And you know what? It looks much like what our first quilts would have looked like. Hangs kind of wonky. But you know what? She made it and she finished it. And now just take a look at what she does today. Beth Ann is also well known for couching threads. And so, Alan, if you can get a picture of these clothing pieces and the bench. And most of that is done with couch thread. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. She certainly does beautiful work. And and now we're walking into the area where we have our quilts that are from Japan. And this is the winning quilts from the 14th Quilt Nihon exhibition from Japan. And when you look at these, I want you to pay attention to the different kinds of fabric that they use because they use pieces of old kimonos and, and other different styles of fabric from what we Americans use in our quilts. And then if we step right over here, you're gonna see that we have Quilts of Valor. And AQS has partnered with Quilts of Valor for all of 2019. And so this is a special exhibit. They also have a book that's a fundraiser related to this exhibit. And you'll see we have lots of red, white, and blue but these quilts will eventually be given to military, active military and veterans who have been touched by war. And they to date have given away to our military people over 214,000 quilts. If you wanna participate in that, the gals here will be able to tell you exactly what you need to do so that you can make blocks, you can make quilt tops, you can be a quilter, you can put binding on. All of those different things have to happen to finish these quilts. So be sure to stop and take a look at the Quilts of Valor. Now here at AQS Quilt Week in Lancaster, we have things on three different levels. So um, we're gonna take a trip up to the second floor. It's called level two on the elevator. And uh, we'll see what's up there. We'll be back in a minute. Now we're in the Commonwealth Ballroom on level two here at the Lancaster County Convention Center. And on this level, we have the wall quilts. So we're just gonna take a little trip down one of these aisles here so that you can see uh, that we have all different styles of quilts. Um, some of our contest categories are divided by the way they're quilted, whether it's by hand or on a home machine or a long arm machine. And so you can see we get quite a variety of quilts uh, because of that. Yeah. 
Also on this level, we have the Prince exhibit, 75 quilts, all related to uh, Prince, who is from Minnesota, and so is Cherrywood Hand Dyed Fabrics, who sponsors this exhibit. And also in, in the back wall here, we have an exhibit from Spain. And these quilts were made by Cecilia and Mary C. Gonzalez. And what they chose to do was make quilts that related to food and drink. I would encourage you to read the tags. Uh, try to guess what it is before you read the tag. And then read the tags because uh, they've done a fun job of being able to translate food and drink into fiber. And on this wall, we have the SACWA, that's the Studio Art Quilts Association, and they have an exhibit that's called Tranquility. And so they were supposed to portray serenity, peacefulness, and you can see that they've done it in a variety of ways and used a lot of different techniques as well. Now, if we just step right around the corner, we can see the best wall quilt and our other winning quilts in these categories. So the best wall quilt was made by I'm going to read the tag because I don't remember. Nancy Starrett Martin and Karen uh, Sistick. And Nancy is from Owensboro, Kentucky. Again, there's a lot of couching on this particular quilt. So you can see that's something the quilters are doing these days. The best traditional design is Beth Neufer and Clem Buzik. And on this side, we have Karen St or Janet Stone won the best stationary machine workmanship. So Janet won best of show, best stationary machine workmanship. So now let's take a trip up to the third level and see what we have there. 2019 is the 35th anniversary of the American Quilter Society. And one of the things that we're doing in conjunction with our anniversary is we are giving away a red and white quilt. This is the quilt that we're giving away here in Lancaster this year. And all you have to do is sign your name on these iPads because by Saturday afternoon, somebody will win this red and white quilt. Now we're headed into Heritage Ballroom E. The area where you see the chairs here is our learning center. And surrounding the chairs in this particular area are quilts from our AQS authors and iQuilt instructors. And we will have vendors that will also be doing demonstrations in this particular area. And those are schedule that schedule is in our show book. Now we are really excited about this exhibit. Do you know, every year in Paducah, the Best of Show quilt uh, be becomes the property of the National Quilt Museum to their permanent collection. And we are privileged to be able to have 15 of the quilts that have won Best of Show at the AQS Paducah Show, AQS Show in Paducah. And so you want to spend some time. We start with 1985. And this is Catherine Inman's quilt, applique. You know, at that time, a lot of people were just doing piecing, so having an applique quilt was really different. You'll see Carol, Carol Fallert's Corona II. This is the first quilt that won Best of Show that was quilted on a home sewing machine. And it really is an iconic piece. And I believe it will never go out of style just because of the techniques she used and the coloring she used. We have Dawn Amos's quilt from 1990. The quilt by uh, Ann Oliver was 1992. Now I know at the Quilt Museum, Jonathan Shannon's Airshow quilt is one of the most popular quilts in their exhibit. Philippa Naylor was 2003 with Limelight. 
Sue Nichols and Pat Holly with the Beatles quilt in 1996. Linda Roy, 2004. And this quilt, Sharon Schomber happens to be the only quilter who's won Best of Show at the Paducah Show two years in a row. The first year was 2006, and that quilt has a lot of crystals on it, so it doesn't travel as well. So this is her winning quilt from 2007 called Flower of Life. You'll want to spend some time up here, though, because these are really fantastic quilts. And then we have our new AQS member lounge. And here's Robin. Hi, Bonnie. How All right, are you? so tell us what's in here and what they can do in the members' okay. lounge. Okay, well, I just lost Judy, I see. Judy's, well, Judy's one of our volunteers <laughs> from the Guild this year here in Lancaster, and she's helping out in the lounge, just greeting AQS members, giving them a place to rest, charge their phones, get a glass of water. Just kind of, you know, get get a little more energy to go back and do the rest of the show. And so. we're doing this at all of our shows, too, aren't we? Yes, we're yeah. going to have a, a pretty big area, much bigger than this when at the Paducah show. Oh, excellent. Yes. That's great. Yeah. All right. So when you come to the show and you need to get off your feet, here's a chance for you to come and sit at a table and have a conversation with quilters from other areas. That's right, from around the world. That's yes. right. All right. Thank you. Thanks, Bonnie. Okay, so now, if you can't come to the show here in Lancaster, because we know not everybody can, we still have four more shows this year. We will be in Paducah, our spring show will be April. In August, we'll be in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Our fall show, which is our big birthday celebration in fall Paducah. And the end of September, that's in September, and then the end of September, we have a brand new show that's Charleston, South Carolina. And I know that there are many of you that are out there that don't know exactly what you do to get registered. All you do is go to quiltweek.com, pick the show that you want to find more information on, and you can go in and register. You can read about parking, scooter rentals, uh, quilt appraisals. We do quilt appraisals at every single show. And here in Lancaster, if you have a quilt that you would like to have appraised, or maybe you just want to know how old is this quilt, our certified appraisers can tell you that information, and they're going to be doing it from 9 until 4 on Thursday and Friday here at the Lancaster County Convention Center. Uh, the cost for that is $75, and all you need to do is check in to the AQS Information Center that's right down in the lobby. I just wanted to ask you too, can you tell us a little bit about Quilt TV? Oh yes, you know, we do these videos at every show, don't we? Yes. We're doing videos with everybody. We do videos with winners. We do videos like this. We do tips with our instructors. So if on YouTube, go into YouTube and then search for Quilt TV. Just run Q-U-I-L-T TV, all run together and there's what are we up to? A thousand? Oh, thousands, right? Yes, thousands. yes. yes. Okay. You can learn a lot by watching <laughs> Quilt TV. Um, and then I want to encourage you to subscribe while you're there because if you subscribe, every time we post a new video, you're going to get an email that tells you about that. Yeah, that's great. Well, thank you, Bonnie. Okay. Thanks for that. Thank you. All right. So we want to see you at one of our AQS Quilt Week shows. We always have at least 500 quilts. Sometimes it's closer to 700 quilts on exhibit. And of course, we have a merchant mall with all of the very latest products and our educational system where we teach people how to quilt. We do one hour lectures. We do the free demos on the floor. We do three hour classes. We do six hour classes. Once in a while, we do a two day class too. Um, so there's plenty of you if you want to learn how to quilt or learn more about quilting or learn those very latest techniques. AQS Quilt Week is the place to be. We hope we'll see you at one of our shows soon.